Hello and welcome to this week's Angel Oracle card reading for week commence in the 18th of November 2024. My name is Ray and I'm a guide who helps you remember your divine presence so that you can heal your past, find your purpose, create your future, to raise your consciousness, understand your reason for being here, come out of that spiritual closet, remember your divine presence so that you can take charge of your destiny to spread your wings and soar. Now, this week we're going to be using the Dragon Oracle cards by Dana Cooper. But as always, before we get into this week's reading, I would like to say thank you so, so much for your continued support. It really does mean a lot to me to be able to be of service and help you on your spiritual path. And thank you so much, you know, for those that have taken my Get to Know and Understand Your Chakras program, um, Step Into Confidence program, you know, and have angelic Reiki with me, past life regression, future life progression. It really is an honour to help you on your journey, to help you navigate your way through life at this moment in time. So as always, I'll give the cards a quick cleanse and a bless. So what does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good for week commencing? the 18th of November 2024. Oh, okay, we'll definitely go with that one. What does everyone who's watching this need to know for their high school? A week commencing the 18th of November 2024. Okay, so we've got flying cards everywhere today. Um, obviously, they want me to work for the cards, but we'll choose the last one. I'll not work for the cards. So, the cards that jumped out were Crystal Yellow Dragon, opens you to higher learning and wisdom, expand your crown chakra for illumination, walk the higher spiritual path. And the other card that jumped out was Orange Gold Dragon from Arcturus, opens you to knowledge for the new golden age, carry the energy of the future, be a guiding light. And then the other card is the blue, dark blue galactic dragon, Helps you to listen to the voice of the universe. Ignite the codes of your master blueprint. Access cosmic wisdom and enter higher service. I mean, these are such beautiful cards, you know, and the fact that we've got their um, oranges and um, yellows and blues is absolutely amazing. So what the cards are saying this week um, is that, you you know, you really do need to... and. We're getting more and more of this coming through. Open up to that higher wisdom and knowledge that is there ready for you to tap into. You know, you already have that knowledge, that wisdom. You just need to tap into it to open up, to, to allow it to come into your brain, into your heart, into your words. Um, you know, so that you can start walking your spiritual path. You know, it could be that you even start walking your spiritual path and then that wisdom and that knowledge comes in. So what is your, you know, what is your spiritual path? What are you here to, to do for people? You know, there's a lot of energy coming in and when you tap into that energy and know that the future is golden and you are part of that future, whatever you do now, you are that creator of that future, not just for you, but for future generations. You know that you are the guiding light, you know, you can set in motion the wisdom, the knowledge that will be of benefit to those in the future. And if you take the time to actually listen to, to the voice, that inner voice, that higher knowing, that galactic information that is that is coming through, you know, we've been, there's been lots of energy shifts, lots of information coming in, which we've all been receiving. It's just that we don't always take notice of it. We don't understand that it's coming here. So this is the time, you know, to, to sit with it, to meditate, to look at the stars, the moon, you know, accept that there is more in the, in the world, in the universe than just us here. And by doing that, you tap into that inner wisdom, that that knowledge, and you can you can create that that future um, in in the present, so that there is a golden future for everyone out there, including yourself and the future generations 
from you. So this week is very uh, much galactic, esoteric. Um, maybe that's why the uh, dragon cards called to come out today. Because, you know, dragons like to work with us to create a better humanity, to create a better earth where everyone lives in peace and harmony with each other and supports and lifts each other up. So really this week, tap into that higher wisdom, that higher knowledge, maybe through guided meditation, maybe through connecting with people that can help guide you, not tell you, but help guide you to remember that knowledge and to actually start using it to create that perfect future for you and everyone else around. Yeah, and that's really the only information they're giving me this week. And as always, I draw these cards for what you to know for your highest good. So you may get a completely different interpretation from these cards. And that is absolutely fine. So the cards that came out were the crystal yellow dragon opens you to higher learning and wisdom. Expand your crown chakra for illumination. Walk the higher spiritual path. What wisdom, knowledge, what esoteric information can you actually tap into? Can you study? Can you learn? Can you download? Orange Gold Dragon from Apturius opens you to knowledge for the new golden age. Ca carry the energy of the future. Be a guiding light. What do you want the future to be? Start creating that now so that it comes in sooner rather than later. And Dark Blue Galactic Dragon helps you listen to the voice of the universe. Ignite the codes of your master blueprint, access cosmic wisdom and enter higher service. So listen to your intuition, to the guidance of the universe. Take the time to meditate. Whether you need help or guidance from other people or you can do it your, yourself, just know that there is a higher service for you out there and connect with the dragons. You know, the dragons can really help you remember that information, that wisdom. You know, I have a, a guide meditation to meet your dragon. There are other guide meditations out there to meet and work with your dragons. So start working with them. Anyway, please do let me know in the comments whether these cards resonated with you, whether you got your own interpretation, because I always love to hear from you. And I always reply to anyone who messaged me publicly or privately. Um, and of course, don't forget to check out everything I offer, whether that's past, future, angels, cards, um, chakras, confidence, um, you know, my uh, soul path discovery program. You know, there are, there are so many things that I offer. And of course, don't forget to check out my show, Angels and Destiny, which if you're watching this around today on Sunday the 17th, takes place on Monday the 18th at 8 p.m. UK time, where my guest is a returning guest, Sophie Fox, beautiful angelic energy, and I'm really looking forward to, um, to chatting with her. And she's gonna go into how you can actually use your, your, your body as an oracle, which is gonna be absolutely amazing. And don't forget, every Friday at 3 p.m., I go live um, doing a oracle card and meditation for a weekend reset for you. Um, it's only about half an hour, but it's absolutely amazing. You get a card for um, for the weekend and the following week, as well as a guided meditation to help you um, with the information from that card. And three people will get a free um, card reading for me as well. And I've got a new show with the beautiful Sally Hart starting on the 5th of December. So um, do look out for information on that. Um, which is going to be a cup of spirituality, as in TEA, um, where we will be answering any questions that you have got about anything spiritual, esoteric, those things that, that you wish you knew. So whether you're starting on your spiritual path, you're a bit further on, you know, we will be answering the basic questions, the questions that you give us um, to help you have a better understanding. But anyway, that's all that's all to come. So have a wonderful week. Um, enjoy working with the dragons. Take care. Bye.